Hey everybody, this is Sarah, the Catholic homemaker. Today I wanna to show you how to make rosemary, garlic, air fryer fries. And first of all, welcome to everybody who is new to my channel and everyone who is coming back. I would love for you to consider subscribing to my channel so we can continue to grow this community. Also consider hitting the thumbs up button if you like this video and the notification bell for all notifications so you know when I post, which is every Monday at 12 noon Eastern Standard Time. Also consider sharing and commenting below your favorite way to enjoy fries. All of this just helps more people to see my videos and my channel. First thing you wanna do is wash the potatoes. I'm actually gonna keep the skin on because we like it that way and it has less waste. There's actually nutrients in the skin, so it is good for you. And I just have a small amount here. These are organic russet potatoes because they're usually the cheapest organic ones, but you can use Yukon gold or other potatoes if you wish. Here I cut up all the potatoes and you can see about what size they are. I just tried to make them the most, uh, not exactly the thinnest, but the most bite size pieces. You can do it to your preference, obviously, but the thicker they are, the longer they will take to cook. The thinner they are, the shorter cooking time, obviously. So now I'm gonna put them in a bowl and marinate them. So I put them in a mixing bowl and now I'm just gonna drizzle with some avocado oil just to coat them. In an air fryer, you actually don't need that much fat, but, um, you know, we're not afraid of fat in this household. We know that it's good for you. And actually, we prefer to use lard or tallow, but we are pretty much out. We need to render some more. We just bought some leaf fat at the farmer's market yesterday, so it has to be... It has to be rendered. So that's why I'm just using avocado oil. Okay, so... You can also season with other things at this point, but my advice is to just season with salt at this point so that nothing burns in the air fryer. The salt won't have an effect on burning and I'm just using tongs to mix it all together. You really need a lot salt for fries just because potatoes just um, absorbs a lot of the salt. Let me show you what I have. We have a Cuisinart toaster oven air fryer and this is the air fryer basket and tray that you put onto the middle shelf to cook. So now we're just going to put the fries that have not been cooked on there and the key with this is you do not want to overcrowd because it will take longer to cook so I usually put it all into a straight line and try to give it as much space and then the cooking time will be less everything is ready and I tried to space it out as much as I could so that they're, they weren't overcrowded. So now I'm just gonna put it right into the toaster oven. You can see I put it on the second or the middle shelf here. And so now I'm gonna turn the temperature to 400 degrees. You want it set to air fry, which is all the way over here. And I'm gonna set it to a little less than 10 minutes. I'm gonna keep an eye on it because I think this is maybe at like the eight minute mark because um, especially since they're smaller, they might start to burn and I've definitely burned fries before. So definitely keep an eye on it. Maybe just do a minimum or a, a maximum of five minutes and just see how they are after five minutes. In the meantime, I'm going to prep the toppings, the fresh rosemary and garlic. So the fries cooked for about eight minutes. That seemed to be an appropriate amount. You could do it a little bit longer, but again, you'd wanna watch it very closely because as you can see, they started to brown already. 
and you don't really want to get it much past that point or else it'll start burning. So I didn't even use all of the fries. I'm going to have to do a whole nother batch. Here are the toppings I got. I got fresh rosemary from our herb garden and I chopped up three cloves of fresh garlic. And we're just going to mix those with the fries over here. Okay, so I have put the rosemary and garlic on. You guys can do it to your liking. I like to just really coat it on there. And now you guys can enjoy it. Here's the end product. I paired it with some organic ketchup. You could also pair it with organic mustard or mayonnaise. I love both mustard and mayonnaise on my fries. Definitely try it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments. And I hope you have a wonderful week. And may God bless you and your families.